Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and to answer the questions that have arrived with the uh, enrollment and the extended security update program for Windows 10 and also to debunk a lot of the users that say uh, things that aren't true. Here is uh, the big picture of this enrollment. So in Windows 10, you should now have enrolled in the extended security updates for a year with Microsoft. Some of you, instead of doing that, went to Zero Patch, which is a third party company that offers five years, maybe more. It depends on my, you know, how many people are going to be left on Windows 10 at the uh, five years. So the first one is um, a lot. I've seen a lot of comments, people saying it's not one year, it's three years. It's not three years. It's one year. Three years is enterprise only, and it is one year for the uh, update for Windows 10. And Microsoft will probably not extend that. Could they? Maybe. It's not impossible. Uh, if they would have enough pressure to do so, they could technically. Uh, but the uh, thing is, um, Microsoft wants you to move to Windows 11, so it doesn't. It, it is not interested in extending this more than a year. It's actually doing it kind of little, you know, probably forced to do it a little bit because they see that a lot of people hang on to Windows 10. Now, um, the other question uh, that I've seen from a few people, is that going to happen the same Patch Tuesday of every month? Um, I don't see why it would be anything else than on the second Tuesday of every month, like all the updates were until now. Um, there shouldn't be a difference on that. So the uh, time should continue to uh, work in the same way, the timeline of the updates. Um, <clears throat> the other thing about the updates um, is that there is a possibility to move on. A lot of people have asked me after this free year, can I go to a zero patch? You can go to zero patch at any time. So as long as you have Windows 10, if you decide to go to zero patch or Maybe you reinstall Windows 10 on an old machine two years, three years from now. You'll be able to go to Zero Patch and add the security updates that Zero Patch offers. There's no um, you know, time frame. You can do it at any time. You just you know, log into Zero Patch and um, you know, subscribe for the uh, uh, security updates. Uh, apart from that, once again, I want to mention that the uh, Windows Defender, Windows Security app will continue protecting you until 2028. That's three years, but uh, it is not something that you want without security updates, which are way more important. Security updates fix security flaws. Windows Security is there to detect if something you know, maybe you click on a virus, you click on some malware somewhere. It's there to try to prevent that from infecting a machine. It's a different thing. An antivirus or a malware software is there to track down bad code that could enter your operating system and stop it before it infects your machine or um, remove it if it already did infect your machine. But it's different from security updates, which simply um, will actually fix security holes in the system. The reason why I always say that the security holes are more important to fix than the antivirus itself is simple. Uh, more than 90% of all malware out there are meant to exploit the security flaw. So when the security flaw is fixed, it just can't do that anymore. Um, they do that because it's easier. Uh, it's really a small percentage that are actually malware that can infect at any time anything. And even that, you know, the antivirus is not 100%. There are no 100% antiviruses. And once again, there are no better antivirus than anything else. Whatever you use is fine, and that's it. Um, it doesn't matter because what's important is fixing security flaws and your habits online. 
not antivirus. So uh, one year, will Microsoft extend it for more? I don't think so. Yes, you can go to zero patch, or you can take that time to see if you're moving on to something else, uh, mainly for most people, Windows 11. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.